Hi, it's Megan. I have done a bunch of videos lately for kind of the red lip and the more neutral looking eye or the more smoky looking eye. And I was really thrilled to see the Urban Decay Pulp Fiction collection because I really think this look is a good one. It just works in a lot of different ways. And if you want to go super natural, you can get rid of the red lips and just do the natural kind of brown thing going on with your eyes. The topes, the, you know, the bones, all that. So I just like this classic look. I think it's a great look. And I like red lipsticks. So I got three pieces from the collection. I got the eyeshadow palette, I got the lip pencil, and I got the lipstick because those are the things that I will use. And I'm going to do three separate videos, one for each of them. So this one is for the lip pencil. So it's, you know, the typical upside down Urban Decay packaging. No, not upside down. That says Pulp Fiction on it. And it's a regular size. This is $20 for 0.04 ounces. And it's called Urban Decay Mrs. Mia Wallace 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil. And I liked the movie. Can't say I love the movie, but I really like the look that Uma Thurman had in the video. I mean, obviously, we all can't look like that, but we can try. Um, so this is described as a blood red. It's a, basically it's medium dark. It's cool and it's a matte finish. So you can see it on my lips. And the thing I like about the Urban Decay pencils is that they're super creamy and they're really great to get coverage. These are just they're not quite a lipstick, but they're almost blend on. You can't like purse your lips and blend them, but you can with an eye with a lip pencil. So this is what it looks like. And then if you see, I got a really even application. It's not at all stiff, pasty, chalky, and this is waterproof, which it wears so well. Um, I got, God, how long does it wear on me? I got about, I actually wore it rarely like this. I mostly wore it with the uh, lipstick. So I got about six hours wear, which is really long for me. So. And I'm going to also swatch the lipstick. Oh god, I've got a little bit. I did get a tiny bit of staining, which is still on my wrist. So there's the color. There's the color. And it is this beautiful matte. Um, and it was very even in its wear, too. So I didn't get... With red, sometimes I get kind of... It wears out right in this area because it's such a bold color. If it doesn't stain, I can see it fading fast. This didn't bleed. It did make the lipstick adhere a little bit better, although Urban Decay's formula is one I like. It didn't crease. It didn't bunch up. It didn't wear unevenly. And it wasn't drying on me at all. Now, I don't have a dry lip problem. So I'm going to show the lipstick with it, too. So this is the lipstick. The lipstick comes in a cool black case. But I'm just going to show you so you can see. And these are meant to match together. I thought the lipstick was a bit lighter. Well, there you have it. That's it. I'm going to end the video now. Please subscribe on YouTube if you have thoughts or comments. And then I'm also putting a novel on YouTube called Masks, which is about makeup and the masks we wear. So I'll put a link to those chapters in the description to this video.